Hey. <laughs> How's it going? Almost pulled a muscle there, but just, just hanging out. Yeah. Just torpedoed in here. That was some big T energy. Energy. <laughs> some big tit energy. That <gasps> was. You gotta coin that. That's a good one. You like it? Like it? Yeah. yeah I like you were like a hurricane or a tsunami or oh. a um, typhoon or a wrecking ball. A wrecking just call ball. me Miley. Oh, yeah. And Is she a, a nerd? <laughs> I wanted to do it. You are a canceled. <laughs> Always canceled with this one. Okay, so what we're gonna do. I think we're actually gonna release this video either tonight or tomorrow because I want to talk about it before the tomorrow's game day. Tomorrow's game day, 4th of July, people. Please, we talked about this in another video. Stay at home, watch CBS All Access because don't go out. And if you go out, please wear a mask. Please, please, please. But we're gonna talk about the games that have already happened because we haven't really talked about them and. Let's talk about them. So a couple things happened. <laughs> Kelly O'Hara is not playing. She has a Achilles and what kind of injury? Quad. She had a quad injury. I believe. She's not playing. Jess McDonald also has an injury, so she's hip not playing. Injury, so hip injury. So uh, I joked she gave birth. Oh, she did give birth like, like some years, years ago. ago. Yeah. So she's <laughs> not playing. So it's, some things have been shaken shaken up a little bit. I don't know if Kelly O'Hara is going to play again. I don't know if Jess McDonald is going to play again. So that's kind of oh. And was Becky injured? No, I don't I don't know if I heard that. Let us know down below. Okay, so let's go back to a couple of the games. This is gonna be a pretty quick video. I just wanna kinda go back to some of the games. So we talked about the games that happened on Saturday the 27th. Tuesday, they had two games. Houston Dash and Royals. That has been the best game so far. The yeah. Dash and the Royals. It was the one we missed live. We, we missed kinda watched some. We watched it because live after we came back and if you have cbs all access they they put them on demand so you, it, it, they, what yeah. time did they show up like three or four hours after the yeah. game like hours after so but. you there's like a three or four hour delay and then you can watch it but mm -hmm. that was the best game i mean it had it was scoring and there was yellow cards a rod got a yellow card um, <laughs> no, um you you were looking up uh what was going on in the game you go oh there's been a yellow card and yeah. then and then you go, oh, I bet it's A Rod. I bet it's A Rod. And then it was. And that was A Rod. <laughs> yeah, yeah, totally, totally. She called it. So it was A Rod. And then there was another yellow card. Um, I don't know the player's name right now off the top of my head. So Vero kicked it in for a free kick because it was a handball. It was a handball. Oh, it, was it Denise? The little short, cute little petite. Thing. Yeah. Yeah, it definitely was right. You guys know exactly what I'm talking about. Her name is coming up a blank on my head. So Vera kicked it. It was a handball, which the handball was crazy it was there's nothing she could have done yeah. so she goes she goes to get the ball because so Firo scored goes in then the the player i'm talking about who ended up getting the yellow card she went to go in get the ball jane campbell was not having it they got into a like Yo, a little scrum she towered over her she's like and she grabbed it and she goes like, no you're not getting no, it no. yeah it was like, it was so jane iconic. campbell mm. yeah she was not having it. And you could kind of hear like a little, uh, from the piped in fake crowd noise, you could kind of hear yeah. um, that you could hear someone say, get the ball, get the ball. But I don't yeah. know if she was saying get the ball, like, get the ball, like, block the ball or get the ball, like, get the ball. Maybe she well, wanted she the ball. She wanted to get the ball. She wanted like the game ball to, yeah. because it was a first like, no. Yeah. But this is the crazy. She got a yellow card for not, not Jim Campbell, the person who in my mind's, um. Denise something. And I'll put it on the screen when I find it. Yeah. Um, so she got a yellow card, but the commenters never even, Lori Lindsay and the other guy never even commented about it. I watched over the game and they didn't really. She was shook if. Like, why didn't you talk about it? Like. This is editing Sarah. Sarah's over there. Say hi, Sarah. Hi, Sarah. And I was just talking about how the uh, feed we were watching on CBS All Access when Diana Matheson got the yellow card. They didn't really mention it, like Lori Lindsay and the other guy didn't mention it, but I'm watching a feed here online that I'm gonna take a clip from. They're like mentioning it, like, oh, look at they win. She tried to grab the ball. Like the Lori Lindsay CBS All Access one didn't really talk about it. So I don't know if they just didn't care, whatever, but it's interesting how different broadcasts are saying how they kind of interpret the game a little bit differently or whatnot. I think this one might have been from the Twitch stream because we're watching it from the CBS All Access stream. But I just want to mention that now because I thought it was I just thought it was funny that once Sarah and I watched it, we're like they made no deal about her yellow card. Um, but yeah, that was it because in baseball girl, they're all over it. So okay, talk to it. Because in baseball, something like that happens, they are all over it. Let's Isn't analyze. Baseball's boring, and that's the most exciting thing that happens all game. I don't know. What? I think they should have analyzed. Hey, look at them. Look at they're they're in a scrum. They're in a they're hey in a over, over there. there. Can, Can you feel me? Am I coming on too strong? 
No. Uh, that was horrible. So that was my favorite part. Um, Duis was playing. They look good. So would you say that Dash is your favorite team? Dash is my favorite team. Dash, um, Dash, Dash. Also, so oh. Rachel Daly should have had three goals. 100%. The officiating has not been consistent in that regard. Um, yeah, yeah, so Rachel yeah. should have had three goals, and they didn't. And if my favorite Katya was the ref, it would have been a goal. <laughs> Katya's my favorite. So I like the game. Royals look good. <laughs> Houston, I thought looked. I thought they looked good. Three. It was an exciting game. That's been my favorite game to watch so far. Probably because they were scoring, and I really like Christy. I really like Rachel. I really like the Dash team. Christy did an interview talking about they really feel connected to each other. Like out of, out of all the people who've been on their team since they've been playing, they really feel like they have a real tight team this year. Okay, good. Royals look good. Obviously, Kristen and Kelly weren't playing, but I thought they looked really good. Um, Rain and Sky Blue, good game, zero zero. So it was boring a little bit. Yeah, like some of these zero zero games, I was like, you know, it's hard to get into the zero on. zeros uh, unless it's like really, yeah riveting stuff i don't know possession time on each of the um rain to sky blue but sky blue i thought looked really good i thought sky blue looked really good mccall looked yeah. really good she won player of the match yeah she like looked that. really good um a couple of I thought overall they look good sky blue i love the kits we talked about them last video yes. that's good um yes, kits but it was kind of a i don't want to say a boring of a game but it was you know not the most exciting and then we go the next day july 1st portland Chicago getting 0-0. Zero, zero. Casey, Alyssa Nair wasn't playing. There were a lot of the uh, people who were playing the first game didn't. Um, but the usual people were on it. They had like a whole new lineup. Like, yeah. Um, yeah. Which was, it was refreshing. And we're getting know. excited learning the new players too. You know, yeah. should I be studying these players a little more to see exactly who they are? Probably, but. Let's, scrap, let's start scrapbooking these players. Ah! So scrapbook. It's such, such a girl thing to do. That's a lesbian girl thing to do. Let's scrapbook. I love it. But Savannah McCaskill played and that game she looked really good. She kept going down. Oh, was that the one that everyone was trying to murder her? Yes. They were trying to take her out? Yes. She, time after time, boom, I she looked slid. and she's freaking down on the ground. She slid from yes. her. Yes. Yeah. She's she like, Savannah and alone. Also, yeah. And also that game is where Lindsay Horan got a really bad turf burn. We saw it, that turf burn. Oh, yeah. Oh, it wasn't. That was and that's what people say. Grotesque. No turf. No turf. It's... It's it, you get injured. And it looked full, oh. and then North Carolina to Washington Spirit zero. Um, so it was zero zero going into halftime again. Um, some people say Roosevelt didn't look as good as she did. I guess I thought she still looked great. So Roosevelt didn't look as good as I think they thought she looked the game up. I thought she still looked really good. And then North Carolina Courage first half they didn't have um, they didn't have Crystal Dunn. They didn't have. Sam Mewis. They didn't have. Was Abby Dahlheimer? Did she come in? I don't in? think she even played. Did no, she? but they brought in three heavy hitters for the second half. Basically, we're gonna get this done. We're and then they scored. We're shutting it One down. To zero, right? And then they shut it down. The two to zero was the final <laughs> score. Oh, Lynn Williams, I think, was in both halves. But the second half, they really brought in Sam Mewis, um, Crystal Dunn, and one other player. But Lynn Williams, I think she scored both of the goals. Wait, there was two goals? Yeah, see right here. Oh, two okay, two zero, not one zero. Yeah. Excuse me. Lynn Williams, she looks good. She has a good team around her to make her look good. Sam yeah. pees with the ball so well. I was rooting for her spirit. You were? Yeah. That's I mean, the Courage's lineup is just so superior to, superior to a lot of the other lineups. It's just like... Yeah, well, I need to calm it down a little yeah. bit. Yeah. Right now, they're the team to beat. I actually want to change that. I know. I don't know. But they have such a good team, and I like the individual. I like the individual people on their team. Yeah. Um. Sure. So that's kind of the lowdown for the last couple games. What did you guys think? Tomorrow is Saturday, July fourth. It's gonna be Utah against Sky Blue. We have mm -hmm. we have Sky Blue. That's who we want to win. Dash versus Rain. Definitely Dash. Yeah. That's definitely. that's who kind of I'm rooting for for this tournament is Dash. Definitely. Definitely. De 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 definitely. 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 Um, some miscongeniality, definitely. Is it? Is it? Oh, yeah, yeah. And then on Sunday, it's going to be North Carolina versus Chicago, which we have Chicago, Portland versus Washington Spirit. Oh. Portland. Portland? Yeah. 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 So, what did you guys think of the last three games? Three games? Four games? Um, this has been so exciting. And even if Sarah, like, we'll watch the games completely, but sometimes we'll be on our phones or something, but we just having that live sports 
of soccer right now. Yeah, it's exciting. It's it, almost like an event. Like we get our snacks, we make rice krispie treats. Two times. Yeah. <laughs> um, and and when we watch the games, I literally forget that the quarantine is happening. Yeah. Because it's like my brain associates that with oh normal life yes like back in the day when mm -hmm. we used to watch soccer mm -hmm. then i'm like oh there's no fans and stand and yeah. i'm like oh okay that's what's going on but and whether depending on what state you are in even if you're not quarantining we live in massachusetts we've kind of contained it stay at home staying at stay home, at home. Whatevs, whatevs. it's mega rapino has been talking about it it's the new normal it's not changing don't go back to normal life because it isn't normal life it will never go back to normal life mm -hmm. Even until after we get a vaccine, I've heard a couple things. The vaccine might only be 70% um, effective. You can't, some people cannot get vaccines either, which mm. is their 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 body yeah. can't handle vaccines. So just freaking stay home. You gotta stay home. And that's what's great about the soccer. Baseball starting pretty soon. Should we need to make some baseball videos? No. No. <laughs> Questions, comments down below. What did you guys think of the last few games? Um, we've been having so much fun watching them. I don't want yeah. this Challenge Cup to end. It's just like, because there was games on Tuesday and the Wednesday, and we were shook, because we didn't realize the next games were gonna be on Wednesday for some reason. I know. But, um, but yeah, it's like normal life again. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Love it. Questions, comments down below. We'll talk to you later. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.